All of you have it wrong about Deadpool and Wolverine. Cassandra Nova will not be the main bad guy. In fact, I'll go even further to say that she'll actually be helping Deadpool and Wolverine. The movie trailers have been telling us who the real antagonist of this movie is the entire time, and all we have to do is look closely. And so what we've done is we've taken all of the Deadpool and Wolverine trailers and put them in chronological order so that you could see beyond just Easter eggs and piece together the entire story. And so we have to say this, spoiler alert. Let's fucking go. Welcome to another episode of Kalex Encounter. And if you've been here before, so everybody's back. After the party, the TVA is going to crash the sh and they about to take off his little wig, his little piece. Oh, sh I just realized uh -huh. TVA snook up on my boy. Boom. That's at the door. Portal opens up. Boom. Snatched him. Take the wig off. I don't, they did not have to do that. Yeah, that was mad up. unnecessary. That's yeah, fucked that up. Mad unnecessary. Hey, I like your wig. Now just imagine bro hair was real for a second. Like, what was he trying to accomplish? Now he's at the TVA. You appear to have soiled yourself while unconscious. I wasn't unconscious. This is where he's getting recruited, obviously, right? What's bro's name from the Matrix? Agent Smith. <laughs> he beat us away. He beat up with Agent Smith. But look, watch this. I'm gonna say, Mr. Paradox, bad guy. So now he's like, walk with me. We're gonna recruit you so that you could save the MCU. The main timeline is the MCU, and they're hiring him to take out all the other universes so that the MCU could be stable. His name, Mr. Paradox, his real name is Mobius M. Mobius. Mobius, 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 three times. I'm saying they're the same people. All of this takes place before Endgame even becomes a concept. Deadpool is gonna kill him at the end because he's trying to destroy his timeline. We're gonna find out that he's the bad guy later on. So what's gonna happen here, he's gonna give Deadpool a brand new suit. So they're like, all right, cool, we're gonna hire you. Here's a brand new suit. We need you to go find the last Wolverine. After all of that, he finds this Wolverine first. This is his first mission. He finds this Wolverine, which is the Wolverine with the eye patch with the white suit. Daniel Radcliffe, mm -hmm. Harry Potter. Mm -hmm. It's not gonna be Hugh Jackman, and he's gonna kill him. So he's a mercenary taking out Wolverine. Okay, why do you think that's Harry Potter? The same way that they have my boy Mr. Fantastic played by Jim Halpert, they're gonna do that for Daniel Radcliffe. He finds his next Wolverine, which is a little bit more of a challenge, and that is Mr. Hugh Jackman himself. Deadpool is gonna get Wolverine to come with him over to the TVA. So he ends up winning this bar fight. And now they're back at the TVA. I also noticed his nose is slightly broken. I'm pretty sure the moment Wolverine got there, I'm pretty sure he punched that in the face. <laughs> <laughs> There's no other way. This is the TVA floor right here. Yeah, that's why bro's on the floor. He went bananas. He punched bro in the face. So this is going to be the moment where Deadpool realizes, oh, okay, these dudes at the TVA are playing me and they're tweaking. What they really want to do is they want to cancel out my timeline. So he's bullshitting me right now. So he breaks Wolverine out. They break out of the TVA, they're on the run, and Deadpool's like, bro, my friends and family are gonna die if you don't help me. They're gonna do exactly what they did to your universe, to mine. And Wolverine's like, bro, that's not my problem. I missed the part where that's my problem. But they're stuck together because they're on the run from the TVA. And then they start scrapping. Their whole thing is, we have to find Cassandra Nova. She's the only one that can help us. And he's like, fuck you. I'm not gonna help you because Cassandra Nova, let's rewind this. Wolverine got beef with Cassandra Nova. We gonna use the comic books, Old Man Logan. And Old Man Logan, Mysterio was the one that fucked with his brain to have him kill all the X-Men. I'm gonna say in this one, it's Cassandra Nova. And so he has beef with Cassandra Nova because Cassandra Nova is hired by the TVA originally to take out all of the X-Men so that they could clean out the universe. Wolverine finds a way to escape that timeline and that's why he's there. Cassandra Nova is played by the TVA and gets expunged anyway. The fight starts here because Deadpool's essentially calling him a bitch. He's like, yo, like you let your friends die. You're not about to go ahead and save your friends. Like you have another chance. He's like, nah, I'm not gonna go fight Cassandra Nova. He's like, she's our only hope down here. Everybody's telling us to go visit her. And he's like, no, fuck you. So they start fighting. Yeah, hey, but they pretty much gonna be fighting this whole movie. Everything after those first few fights, the sleeves are gone. Now we get the more traditional Wolverine look. I think Deadpool cuts his arms off. And they regrow? Yeah. And now they're in the void, and we're about to introduce Cassandra Nova. This is from Captain America's, the first Captain America. And that's Iron Man on this little shit right here. Oh, yeah, that's a Hydra car. Yeah. I heard saying this is gonna be Terrence Howard. 
<laughs> Boom, here's our introduction to Cassandra Nova. These are the X-Men from the original X-Men timeline. Look, there go your boy Pyro down here. Oh yeah, there you go. Where he's like, I love this part. This is the introduction of Cassandra. So this is my theory. Yes, we know that in the comics, Cassandra is like this super evil villain. They got an MCU with fire. She's not gonna be threatening, she's not gonna be scary. I'm even gonna go further and say, she's gonna be teaming up with Deadpool and Wolverine. Wolverine doesn't like her though, because she brainwashed him to kill her fr his friends. But she sees the bigger picture now. Exactly. So look, so as soon as Wolverine meets her, look, and it's all in the facial expressions. Look at her face, look at her face. She's not a serious person, look at her. And then they get thrown in a prison. My theory is that she's not gonna be that scary or whatever. Further evidence of that is gonna be because, so what's gonna happen is she's gonna be the only one in the void that could get them out of the void to save the timeline. But she wants to stay there because she's having a great time. And here we see Alioth from Loki. So what's gonna end up happening we could see the Ant-Man head down here. So there's going to be a fight here. Yeah, and I think that possibly might be a machine that could possibly hold back Alioth. I don't know if you noticed, but the TV agent, mm -hmm. that's the same TV agent that was trying to be you see the you see the prison in the background in the background? Okay. I, I would assume that's the same TVA agent that was holding right oh, the scene right there. Okay, I see what you're saying. So they're transporting a TVA agent right now. Yes. Okay, and then look, so this is why I'm saying they end up working with Cassandra because she's standing right there. Enhanced, you see a ball head, boom. But I mean, she's not fighting them, so I'm guessing like she's helping them out, right? And then they jump through the portal. But guess who's standing to the right? Cassandra Nova, not fighting or anything. Boom, just standing there. And then boom, they get their little moment where they walk out in slow motion. This is the joke that everybody's talking about, the the Deadpool artist that couldn't draw feet. I think that's such a weird thing that people are so obsessed with. <laughs> like, where do you think he got the gold guns from? Because in the earlier, it was, it was black. Okay, so here's my theory. I believe he's gonna come across several Deadpools. And I don't know if you noticed, but another major spoiler warning, there was leaked set photos of Samurai Deadpool has golden guns. Oh. I think he stole them. You think he stole them from I think Samurai he, I think Deadpool? He, stole them. he was like, wow, those are cool. With the release of Deadpool, we ranked all of the X-Men movies. Click this video over here, and we'll see you in the next encounter. Peace.